Hey Leo, my name is Crystal. I'm going to be doing a current love and a singles love and then I'm going to do a general reading at the end if I have enough time before my phone runs out. Okay, no space. Okay, so I'm going to start with tarot first. So I already reshuffled these and, and did everything that I had to do first and then put it. So that way I don't have to waste your time. Um, I was a lot that kept on falling out. So I said, you know what, I'm just going to take it. This is for the current love. Okay, the Seven of Pentacles tells me that you have to put a lot of time, a lot of energy, and a lot of love into this relationship, right? But, right now, um, somebody is being ingenuine with the Seven of Swords. Somebody is being sneaky, somebody is taking advantage of the other person, somebody is walking all over you, you might not even know it, or the other person might not even know it. Um, if you do, you might be spying on them and trying to see what they're doing, but if not, I feel like this person might be texting somebody behind your back. They have their eye on somebody already, alright? They're not being very genuine, they're lying, they're holding secrets right here with the high priestess. This is about secrets, not saying anything, keeping it, you know what I mean? Quiet, quiet, quiet. This person you could be married to with the four of wands. Okay, you might be in a marriage with this person, you might be engaged with this person, or you might just be very committed to this person, especially with the seven of pentacles. I feel like you guys put a lot of time, energy, and love into this, right? So it might be a lot, um, a relationship that you've been in for a while, right? But with the lover card, I do feel like you guys are soulmates, right? But soulmates are kind of Sometimes just lessen relationships because we learn a lot what we want and we learn a lot what we don't want in these situations, okay? Um, I feel like you are trying to see through somebody. You might be waiting for an apology or waiting for some type of communication from this person. You might be waiting for them to give you a reason why if you found out they were cheating or lying or stealing or whatever the situation is. They were being ingenuine. I feel like you're starting to see through the... Can't talk. Starting to see th through them. <laughs> Alright, by watching them, but um, I feel like if you aren't now, you soon will be, especially with the Six of Wands, okay? I feel like this is going to help you open your eyes and then you're going to feel a lot more better, okay? And what you will find out about um, whatever this is that they're hiding from you. They might be with you for your money, okay? They might be, you see how she's holding on to the money? I don't know if they're the money maker or if you're the money maker, but whoever's the money maker, I feel like it could be somebody there that is there for your money. You got Queen of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, Three of Pentacles, all right? Three of Pentacles is also a card about like three, so it might be an extra person in your relationship. Somebody might be too nosy putting their business in there, trying to feed your head with some stuff that they shouldn't. It might be too much into your business. If not, it could also mean that they're cheating. At least if they're not physically cheating, they're like texting behind yourself cheating. You know what I mean? It might be something that's new. Um, if not, I feel like they are, they're definitely texting behind your back or definitely seeing something or doing something behind your back that you don't know of and they're not telling you, they're keeping it secret, all right? So it keeps on telling me, secret, secret, secret. Then you got palm tree. Stability, security, permanence, growth, endurance, and flexibility. So they might be there for your stability, okay? Financial stability, mental stability. Maybe you have the house, the car, the everything. You know what I mean? Um, date, meeting someone new. Dating, getting back out there. Plan, set a date, okay? So maybe they are texting people behind your back, setting dates, going on dates behind your back. I don't know. If you've been noticing that they're kind of disappearing every now and then, then I would really pay attention to that. The sun card, I forgot to read this. I feel like you guys um, are happy with each other, like legit, like you guys bring each other happiness. So I don't know if this might be a shock to you, but um, I feel like you or the other person or both of you guys can get along really well together. Maybe you joke a lot together. You guys are, you know, vulnerable and open, but I don't feel like one of you guys are being very open anymore. Okay, so you have Enigma. Mystery is present. Information and signs are coming in cold. This is also an omen about yourself or people in your sphere who are being secretive. Hmm. Hard to read or cryptic. Some things just aren't ready to be revealed. You are in pursuit of knowledge that must be earned or people are keeping things from you. Explore more. With the Queen of Swords, I definitely feel like you need to pay attention more. Um, providence. It is by divine intervention that your situation will be handled. This is an outside of this is outside of your control. Expect grand gestures from the universe and spirit. Have faith in the outcome. There are things happening behind the scenes that you are unaware of. All that is happening for you, not against you. Stay in truth and trust the process. So know that the universe is, you know, 
taking things out of your life, um, sometimes when they get ripped away from us, it's because the universe does it because we're holding on to something that's no longer serving us. And the reason why they're doing that is because they have something else better for us waiting. And by us holding on to things that are not working for us no longer, we're, we're, we don't have any room for the better things to come in. So that's why that happens. Then you have karmic justice. This is a time when all wrongs are being made right. Whomever wronged you is about to receive their karmic justice. Allow karma to come in full circle. Be patient. Ask for divine intervention to help you move forward. Trust in the process. You were strong. You're protective. Learn from your mistakes. Don't make them twice. Okay, so that's what I got for you guys. I definitely feel like somebody is being lying here. There's a lot of secret things going here. I don't know if they're cheating, you know, exactly, but I feel like they are not being genuine. So you really might want to keep a close eye on the people that you are with right now, Leo. Okay, so that's what I got for you guys. If they say they got to leave too. I will pay attention. I will follow them. Just saying. All right, so um, Leo singles. You have Union, Angel, Page of Wands, this one, the Judgment, Six of Pentacles, Five of Swords, the Golden Mirror, and Heart with a King. <clears throat> All right, so the Page of Wands tells me that there might be a new message coming in for you regarding some type of love or something that you're, someone that you're passionate about, okay? This person might bring a lot of clarity, a lot of happiness, a lot of joy, a lot of abundance into your life, okay? This might be something that you were waiting for. Um, the judgment card, I do feel like you're going to have to make a decision, okay? Um, there's some type of conflict going on in your life, right? And I don't know what this is, but I feel like once you get rid of this, you make a decision about this to cut this uh, conflict and challenges out of your life. It's going to make it a lot more easier for you to be able to move on with this person. I don't know if it's inner conflict or arguments or battles or whatever it is, feeling defeated. Somebody's feeling defeated here, but as long as they don't let that take them over, you know, things will be fine. Six of Pentacles, this is somebody that, you know what I mean, um, is generous. Okay, this person will be able to share with you, but I do feel like somebody's going through something. I don't know if it's you or them, but I feel like somebody's going through something. It could also be just anxiety, some type of de depression, sadness, worries, and stuff like that. You have the golden mirror, self-absorbed, narcissist, one-sided relationship, love bonding. Okay, I don't know if this was from your past relationship, but if it is, maybe it's just saying try not to follow the same things over and over again. Don't fall down the same path. And then you have heart with a key. Welcome, love, meeting the one, opening your heart, getting together, and perfect. Okay, so somebody has the keys to your heart. They're about to be popping into your life pretty soon. And with the union card, that kind of makes sense. This time has come to break through your barriers of, barriers of fear so that a deeper union can be experienced with others around you. You may be the five of swords then. You might be somebody that's like fighting within yourself to allow love in. And if you are doing that, then you're kind of blocking anybody from being able to get in. So you're never going to be able to get anywhere. So I feel like the union card is just telling you to allow yourself to be open, vulnerable, and available for new experience of intimacy. Unions with love, friendship, and spiritual guidance guides are coming let go of trauma bonds welcome and healthy love yeah the golden mirror might be your trauma bond self-absorbed absorbed narcissist one-sided relationship love bombing so somebody that you were with was not so kind to you in your relationship but it doesn't mean everybody's going to be like that okay and then you have angels your guardian angels are with you it's time to ask for specific signs they can answer directly expect to see sequences of repeating numbers flashes of light <clears throat> Feathers, vivid dreams, or encounters with angelic people who have good souls. Your angels will work through others around you to help you. So just know the, the angels are with you on this um, singles journey that you're looking for love. They're going to make sure that you're able to see clearly, you know, who's right for you and who's not. Make sure you pay attention to the signs they say this all the time. Pay attention to their actions, not their words. They can promise you anything, but what they do is what really matters, right? Okay. <clears throat> now I'm going to do a general reading. Okay, so for your past, you have the Seven of Swords again, <clears throat> the Knight of Swords, and the Moon. Somebody's holding secrets from you. They're being sneaky, 
lying, cheating, stealing, like I said, seven of swords and the moon, that's not good things, okay, this is like, listen to your intuition, you know something's up, you feel something's up, I know you feel something is up, and maybe you don't have enough evidence to, in order to say anything, so you kind of keep it close, you know what I mean, the knight of swords is like, you know, this is somebody who jumps into things without even like, thinking about it without even having a plan so this is like the the message here is to make sure that before you jump into something the next time make sure you logically think about it and look at all the ins and outs of every part of the situation before you go ahead and do it don't jump too fast because you might end up you know in, in the spot where you don't want to be okay so that's your current that's your past and i feel like that um it's still leading into now because of the reading I just did for you guys with the Seven of Swords. Again, the, somebody that you're dealing with is being sneaky. Okay, so for your current, you have the Page of Swords. Again, the Page of Swords, Seven of Swords, the Ace of Swords, and the Star. Okay, so the Page of Swords, somebody is texting, being sneaky. They have their eye on somebody. They're spying on somebody through the internet. Maybe you're spying on them or they're spying on you. Somebody's not to be trusted here and the other person knows it. Okay, if not, they don't know it. I feel like you should keep an eye on this person. One of Cups, the Ace of Swords, basically. Ace of Cups. I don't know why I said that. Ace of Cups. This is like, you know, a new... You're hoping for a new start. You're hoping for a happy ending. You're hoping for, like, this brand new love or whatever. But I feel like you want something, but the other person doesn't want what you want. They're being sneaky. I think they're coming to you for your money. I don't know if they're coming to you for because you have a house or because you have, like, more stability than they do. Or maybe they feel like they can't do anything without you or whatever. But I feel like they're just using you. Sorry. And then even for your future, you have three of wands, which is patience. So the future is just saying, you know, you... You're going to be waiting, okay, for this new door to open up with the world being completion. Something is about to end in the future. And I, th I feel like with that, um, the Three of Wands is where it comes to waiting. I feel like you're waiting for this new start to come in for you guys in the future after this, uh, whatever this is, ends. Okay, this could be, like, now this is a general. This could be friends, family, love, job, co-workers, bosses, anybody. Anybody can be a liar, cheater, stealer. You know, anybody. I feel like you guys are hoping for something better. But, um, or hoping that this person is going to give you better, but I don't think they're going to do that, okay? And then you have the Seven of Wands, which is like bravery, standing up for yourself, guarding yourself, putting barriers around you, not letting other people get too far in, but it's also not putting so much high barriers to where other people can't get in as well. You don't want to lock everybody out, right? Just lock out the people who need to be, um who can't be trusted and I feel like you really need to pay attention to people because they are definitely some sneaky people around you okay so that's what I got for you guys I hope you guys like my content if you guys did please like and subscribe I'm sorry I couldn't give you any better answers I wish I could you know what I mean but you know we all have to go through something in life and it sucks but I wish you guys the best thank you bye